Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing an unboxing and I already cheated and opened it already because that's what I do. And I'm also already have one lit, which I will share which one I purchased. So this is from the Wish Candle Co. And it says a little magic in every candle. I saw this on Instagram and then I started researching a little bit about the company and it's supposed to be a all natural hand poured, uh, natural soy wax, all hand poured. So I'm super excited about these. I've been waiting for these to come in. I got three candles. One of them's already burning. And then I got some wax warmers or not warmers, but wax melts and it's super cute. So it comes with a little pack of stickers, which I absolutely love. It has foolish mortals order candles. It just has a bunch of really cute little stuff. Oh, and it has a book that says princess and the frog, which Tiana is my favorite. So loving this, a little Mickey baguette, super cute. I can't wait to stick those on something. I'll probably stick them on my iPad to be honest. And then it also just comes with like a little postcard, which gives you, um, tips on how to light candles, how to take care of them. And then all, it also lets you know, like what not to do with your candle. So it's really cool. Any eight ounce candle that you order from them, a pin is at the very bottom. Don't know what the pins look like. I didn't look cause I kind of want to be surprised. I don't know if it's like a special pin per each jar or however it works, not really sure. So I'm very excited. Again, I've never purchased from this company before. So I don't know how well the product works, but I am getting a little hint of this scent, which I don't want to mention until I get to it. But the first one that I ordered was, or picked out actually, was Regions Beyond. And it is obviously inspired by the Haunted Mansion. And this one is supposed to smell like patchouli, ger, ger, geraniums, geraniums? <laughs> I can't read. Geraniums, musk, woody base notes. So that's what the scent's supposed to be like. I definitely get the patchouli oil scent from here and it smells really good. I also love that it has the glitter on the top. Um, it looks like it did like a little weird thing on the side, but honestly it doesn't really matter. I'm going to light the candle. So it's super pretty. I'm very excited. I'm loving the color. I'm loving the glitter up top. I'm loving the jars that they also come in. They're just a glass jar. These will be reused because I love little mason jars. So I'm sure I'll find something fun to pour in here or put in here or store something cool. It'd be really cool to do like little, like, what are they called? not aviaries are they called aviaries like where you do like little a little set within like a jar i don't know i think that'd be kind of cool so anyways i'm loving it and i'm super stoked on this one it smells really good it's not my favorite scent in the entire world to be honest i just purchased it because i thought regions beyond haunted mansion i just kind of was sold on that and i know that's kind of stupid because it's like i'm gonna light my candle and it should smell really good i love patchouli this is probably gonna be something i'm gonna light every once in a while it just i feel like it's gonna be a nice one to light when you're taking like a hot shower or something or a bath so loving this scent and then the next scent that i purchased was the royal chariot and i don't know it kind of reminded me from the color enemy of cinderella and her chariot that she rides off into her pumpkin chariot and this one has this really pretty glitter on the top as well so that's probably like their signature thing and this one smells so heavenly. So this one smells like pumpkin, whipped cream, and warm spice. And I get that 100% from taking a sniff of it. Yes, this is so good. I can't wait to light this one. This one actually might even go downstairs in my living room. And it just smells really heavenly. Again, it comes with a pin inside here. And I don't know, like I had mentioned, I don't know if the, each pin is different. So I'm really excited to get to the pin at some point. And then the other thing I have in my box before I show you my last candle, which this is like a really quick unboxing, no joke. This is going to be like, I'm looking at the time. It's only four minutes. Um, and the other thing I got was the cannonball red wax melts. So I'm going to pull it up really quick. Um, if it lets me do it, I'm trying to look on my, there it is. So the cannonball is supposed to smell like gunpowder, smoke, and vanilla. So let's go ahead and open. Okay, I definitely get the gunpowder smell and smoke, and I get a hint of the vanilla. Um, definitely the gunpowder smell definitely takes over. So I'm super excited. It just reminds me of 
the Pirates of the Caribbean, which is my second favorite ride at Disneyland. Uh, not my favorite at Disney World because we don't get that big swoosh at the end and or in the beginning. And I just, I don't know. It's not the same as we get at Disneyland. It's just so much better at Disneyland, but it smells really good. And this seemed really sturdy. So I will say that that's one thing that I'm hoping that it'll melt nicely. Again, I've never purchased from here, so I'm not really sure. And then the last one that I got, which let me pull that one up for you guys. I got the churro hot fresh baked and it is supposed to obviously smell cinnamon, sugary dough, maple and vanilla. Right off the line, hot fresh baked churros coming right up. The scent is truly mouth watering and it seriously is. My room smells amazing and I'm kind of scared to this is like so unsafe do not do this but this is what it looks like as well and yeah so I have it lit so I can enjoy the fragrance and it smells so nice and I'm just going to follow what it says it says to let it melt from each end of the of the candle of like the jar before you turn it off so do not do this this is so stupid that I even did that but yeah I get all paranoid that I'm gonna drop it and yeah, so I'm very, very excited with this candle box. I'm hoping these scents smell amazing. Um, again, this one is probably not my favorite scent. It's not bad, but because I do like the smell of patchouli, but it's not something I'm going to want, you know, lit all the time. It's definitely not a fall scented candle. It's more of like a relaxation scented candle for me. So bath time, shower time, and then this one smells amazing. I can't wait to light this one, but I just really missed churros from Disneyland. So I went ahead and went with that one. Uh, I love it. I think it's really cute. I love the packaging. I love that it comes with little stickers. It comes with a little tips, you know, a little bit of some tips for you to know how to light a candle. Um, I'm hoping that I really enjoy these. So I'm very excited. And I just thought I would share them with you guys. I would definitely check out their website. Again, I have never use their candles before so I'm hoping I really enjoy them and I'm crossing my fingers that I like them and then I'll continue to buy some more so I hope you guys enjoyed this very short box opening with me and I will check in with you guys or not check in with you guys but I'll see you guys later bye